I'm here with Ross McCarn just uh, moments after Lansdowne's uh, second win out of their, their three Ulster Bank League uh, matches this season. And uh, Ross, you must be absolutely thrilled with that win. Yeah, no, it was a great win. We knew Belva were going to come hard on us after. They narrowly lost the first two games and they started really well, so we had to regroup there after they scored the early try and I uh, thought we came back together really well at the end of the first half and then it was close at the end, but uh, I think we closed very pretty well. Absolutely, and you were nearly in for a, a what would have been a smashing try no, yourself. Yeah, Did you yeah. think it was forward yourself? Uh, I didn't think it was, but the fellow passed me said it definitely was. So <laughs> no complaints, I don't think. That's why I must have been forward <laughs> yeah. in that case. Uh, and uh, you're you're strapped there yourself. Did you pick up an injury during that? Yeah, no, I just I hurt my hamstring a little bit last week against Mary, so yeah. uh, it was just a bit of a struggle all week to get back fit for it. But uh, as live, I was able to play in the end. It just tightened up after an hour, so uh, the coach said just to. To come off and before it tears again, yeah. And how did you find the Aviva Stadium no, for uh, yeah. an Ulster Bank League match? Yeah, we didn't even uh, do the warm up or anything on us, just running on to us with three at the start. But uh, I think Belva probably found their feet on it quicker, but it was just kind of when you took a second look around, it was fantastic. Yeah, you guys settled though after about 20 minutes and started yeah. playing some really good rugby, yeah. which is really positive for the oh, season yeah, ahead. Great. We've, you know, we've been training well, we're kind of getting used to Mike and Emmett now as our coaches and the game plan they've kind of put in place, we're, we're actually executing now quite well. So we knew once we just hit our straps that we'd be okay and come back and put them under a bit of pressure. I think we, we scored, uh, scored a good try and maybe that four pass and maybe could have got another one after that. But uh, you know, we were yeah. really happy that we closed our played the, kind of the last hour of the game. And host of the season ahead, I mean, it's a very tight league. Yeah. Um, a couple of wins can push you right up the table, and after three matches, you'll be right up there. Do you figure that Lansdowne can really contend at the top end? Yeah, well, hopefully, you know, the old kind of cliche of taking each game at a time. I think, you know, if you look at all the scores, all the teams are so close that it's kind of one score games every week, so you just have to try and perform to your best every week, and, you know, we'll look at the table then after a few, few matches and see where we are. Absolutely. Are you missing the pro game? Um, not really. I did maybe for kind of a year or two after, especially after they won the Heineken Cup. But uh, I'm settled into working now and enjoying my job in uh, Lewis Hound Williams and insurance and uh, loving it down here in Lansdowne. It's great. Yeah. Great. Well, listen, well done tonight. Thanks, great man. win. Yeah. And uh, look after the leg. I'm sure you might have earned yourself a little beverage yeah, there. I'll have a good night tonight. Thanks, Will. <laughs> well done. Cheers. Cheers.